Okay, so I got my little cosmetic sponges. I'm gonna use that little guy right there. Look at how small he is. We're gonna get him to grow. I think it's just so cute how when they like expand. I don't even have stuff on my face yet. Why did I like skip to this? Oh my god, I told I like walked out of this room. I totally forgot I was filming. <laughs> Oof. I don't know where a lot of my stuff is because we just came back from VidCon a few days ago. So I'm just gonna double up my Maybelline foundation for my concealer. So I used to never really like beauty blenders because I just kind of did it the, I don't wanna say like old fashioned way. I just kind of did it the, let me say it, the whatever way. I just always use my hands to put on makeup. So I'm just gonna shake this little dude and I'm gonna put, oh my god, there's water in here. I'm gonna shake this little dude. Come on. I've used so much of this stuff. I think I've had this for like almost, yeah, now. Is this still okay? Is that a little jar on it? Come on. We don't got all day. We got places to go, foundation. There we go. Okay. Now well, this stuff goes like a long, long way. And it says 24 hour covers on it. I legitimately was at VidCon sweating, going around everywhere all day, every day. And this was still on my face. So it definitely works. This is my little dude. What else do we have problems today? Right there. Boom, blemish, gone. Probably want to wipe that off. Dabbing. I'm like looking over here a lot because this is actually where the mirror is. And this is like in like a vanity. I forgot the top of my eyes, but boom, but boom. We're not going to go too crazy today because it's a zobbing of you. So we don't want to look like 5,000. We only want to look like 1,000. Now, because this camera is potato quality, you can't even really tell that much. We got eight hours of sleep and two. I want this to grow. I think it's really cute when I get like really big. I want to get one of those uh, travel beauty blender things, but first I gotta get a job to make money. Why is my forehead so much more, I can't see it, but my forehead is so much more darker than my face. How did that happen? It's still kind of small. Oh, no, he grew a little bit. When we get back, maybe you might get like a bigger. Or when I wash it, it'll get really big. I need a mirror like right here or something, so I don't have to keep looking away, and then you can get all this good, good footage of me doing this. Cause I want to look at myself, but this camera right here is not very accurate. I'm going to scream. I can't find like any of my makeup. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Thank, thank the Lord. I'm going to take my little ankle bush right here. I got to clean it a bit. There's still some gunk on it from all my pretty eyeshadows. Oh my God, this is so dangerous. What a mess. Okay, what is this? I don't even know what this is. I just found this in my house. I think it's my sister and my cousin left this in here. Makeup brush shampoo. What is that? Okay. I put a little in a cotton ball here and then we're just gonna go, ah, look at that. Look at all that goodness. All that goodness coming out in there. Because I'm using another, I'm really just gonna line my eyes with some eyeshadow because Oh, I have my eyeliner here. Yes, I'll be right back. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love this stuff. The Maybelline Eye Studio. I used this for when I was filming my movie and I was a goth or an emo or whatever you want to call me. And like, I like have these huge wings like all the time. And this stuff like saved my life. Okay, so we're not gonna really put eyeliner primer on. I lid primer. How much time we got? Yeah, I'm not gonna really put eyelid primer or maybe I'll do a little quick shadow. Just a little quick shadow because we can't make them feel like I'm a sham. What is a sham? I don't know. Is it like a sham? Like I know it's like a sham. Wow. But like isn't a sham like, I don't know, like someone that doesn't care? I just make that up. Okay, we're gonna do this like a little bit of eyeshadow. Okay, so this video's already 10 minutes. Goal is I'm gonna get this done in five, four, three. So, so I'm just taking my Ulta eyeshadow primer. I you know there's like Urban Daka. Daka. <laughs> I know it's Urban Decay. I know this Urban Daka. Daka. I just call it Daka now. 
I know they have um, that eye potion that everyone in the world has used and that's one like I, I really wanted to wear makeup when I was like very very small when I was like nine or whatever but I'm gonna use this because I went on like a I mean this is really bad and I don't recommend this at all but I was having a retail therapy moment and I really just wanted to get some makeup so I can feel hella good about myself and to enhance my features this is my more I still have the box because I'm hella proud of this because I feel like investing in a Morphe palette is a really big deal. So this is my 3535E Stunning Vibes palette. And you know what? I haven't cleaned any of my brushes and that's very nasty and I don't want to put that on my eyes and they get gross stuff. So I have some sponge applicators. Alright, so how about some little pages and nudes? By the way, I apply eyeshadow like a mess. I'm just going to probably go with that one right there and then maybe just like that one right there just like a little bit of color mm, i might do my i might do my uh wings today i might do a little bit of wings okay how about we just do that for the whole lid that a little bit and that for the crease okay we're not gonna do oh my god i told myself i wasn't gonna do too much it's already almost time to go oh my god did my phone move a little bit okay please don't do that okay all right we're gonna hurry up or else we're gonna be late and i've been late to everything in my life almost almost but i'm working on that allison we're even putting on glasses you don't even have to make your eyeshadow that crazy today oh i'm not used to like talking to this okay then we're gonna take this little thingy right here and it's like kind of like a looks like a latte color right there okay a lot of mocha with some milk in it. Now I got a morning frap on my eyes. Does that make me look hella professional? They're definitely gonna hire me to be just like a basic um, winged island type of gal. But we're gonna go a little adventurous. Five minutes has passed already, what? How? How is five minutes passed already? I say lies, lies, lies. We're gonna take this like really dark red right here. So I'm just gonna wet my brush. We're gonna make it an eyeliner. Now I feel like if you go in to any job interview with like red eyeliner, it might look a little crazy if you remember on the job, really. Oh my God, I have to fix that, okay. But um, my hair is already a little red. It's a little red. But my hair is, my hair is, my hair is already red, and so, um, I feel like, I feel like it kind of goes with it. I'm just gonna add a little bit, because we don't know how conservative these people are. Okay, I'm not gonna do too much. We good there, okay. Can't even see anything, but you know what? Sometimes when you do your makeup, you gotta do little things that are for you can't do it because everyone on Instagram is going to go, oh my god, I forgot about my hair and I said I'd do this in five minutes. But you can't feel like you just want to do it for likes on Instagram. You just want to feel like sometimes you just got to do it for you. Maybe if I turn this. Oh, there we go. You can see a little bit more of action. I should have done this angle earlier. But, you know, what can we do? It's like my real legit first makeup thing. This look is a mess. I feel like... You have to get really good at doing your makeup and talking at the same time. I haven't mastered that at all yet. Is that a little too crazy? Whatever, we'll deal with it. Are you looking at me? Or are you looking at my glasses? When I got that money, I want to get my eyebrows waxed because the last time I got them waxed was in May, which was two months ago. And they've taken a minute to grow back. I used to always get my eyebrows threaded. And then... I started getting my eyebrows threaded when I was like 13. Can you believe that? I was 13 years old and I wanted like nice eyebrows. I think it's because, you know, I think YouTube had like the huge, like the beauty community going on. And so, um, I just wanted to be a woman like that, you know? Who doesn't? Before anyone bitches at me, my eyes aren't even. And so my, my wings, 
are definitely uneven as well. And what I learned is that just like your eyebrows, I think also your eyes are supposed to be sisters, not twins. And plus, if you can um, get your eyeliner perfect, then you're a robot. No, I don't think you're a robot. I just think you have um, a lot of practice. I never get these eyes even. Never in my life. Maybe if like I was sitting in a room with nothing, like absolutely nothing, it's like, <laughs> I'll say whiteness or darkness, cause I guess whiteness, but I mean like light. But if I was sitting in a room, whiteness, probably not darkness, cause then I won't be able to see anything. I could probably get these wings right. But your girl doesn't have time to make this too perfect. We just have to make a statement behind those opticals just for today. Ooh, I gotta let this hair down. Then we gotta eat. And then we gotta get a lip. And then we gotta. Oh, almost done. Almost done. We got to make this two feathered out. Now I'm just. Oh my lord, I just made this. I always make this too big. Okay, you can see when I go really close right here. Oh my god, my eyes look too crazy. This one looks fatter, but you know, we'll deal with it. It's windy outside. We look okay. We look pretty okay. We look pretty okay in there. Okay, well. I'm gonna take this hair down now. We do a little lip on our way there. I don't know how this hair is gonna look. I never really sleep well with curls in. Like with little things like this in my hair, but I think I just got myself to be like really tired or something. Oh, she's cute. What is this, like a, um, I feel like this is very like, those 20s looking finger wavy moment that we're having, it's not too big. I always usually put heat in my hair. So I wanted two inches off, but he cut off three and I was like, oof, it's okay. I like it. Um, I've been trying to tell myself that a high key kind of looks like break up hair, but you know, there's a thing called split end hair when you have too many split ends in your hair and then you're just like, well, what do we do? We cut it off. So. I mean, I tried all the hair masks in the world and all the oils in the world to um, make it a little better, but, um, you know, it comes at a time where you've messed up so bad with your hair that you can't just keep saving it with oils. Okay, do I have any more? No. Nope. Oh, it's a look. It's a look, it's a look. All right, now I gotta go wake up my sister, fix this a little bit, and we gotta get out of here. Ooh, y'all hiring, y'all hiring, y'all hiring? All right, see you in a little bit.